Monday at the Portugal Open and Milos Raonic wasted no time familiarising himself with his surroundings while touring the Volvo Ocean Race Team Alva Medica boat. Faced with the challenge of scaling the 100-foot mast, the Canadian stayed calm under pressure, which was more than could be said for some of the players out on court. In the first of the men's main draw matches, world number 61 Andrei Golubev made a decent start against the volatile Frenchman Adrian Manorino. The Frenchman was feeling the heat. After splitting the opening two sets, Golubev rediscovered his touch deep into the decider. After a gruelling match point, Golubev eventually wrapped up a 6-3, 3-6, 6-4 victory to move into the second round of the ATP World Tour 250 tournament. And finally, get down with my small injuries, you know, small disturbing things, but, and uh, start to work really hard, you know, to get back, it's, uh, it's, it's really, it's, it's harder, especially the second time. And uh, I really had to work really, really tough. Joao Sosa, the tournament's sixth seed, and Rui Machado will be flying the Portuguese flag once they step onto court, but began their week unwinding while trying to master a very different sport at the nearby Jamor Golf Club. Back on the clay, Spanish rising star Pablo Carreño Busto was hoping to continue his climb up the Emirates ATP rankings when he took on eighth seed Mikhail Kukushkin. After a run to the quarterfinals in Casablanca and the third round in Monte Carlo, the young Spaniard looked full of confidence as he cruised through the first set, well on his way to the second round in Portugal, where he reached the semi-finals in 2013. Kukushkin hit back from 2-5 in the second set only for Carreño Busta to step on the gas once more. He dominated the early stages of the tiebreak before going on to wrap up an impressive 6-1, 7-6 victory. Six, one, seven, six.